Try my best. Okay. All right, folks, if you're just tuning in, we are playing Doors, and our champion Cold Rift has been stuck in this library for about approximately three minutes. So right now we have this monster, which has a rib cage on the outside and a circular head. And he's got lots of teeth in his head. So Cold Rift is playing the, is playing the slow game, but uh, I think that they're really doing a great job. Lots of good crawling going on here. Um, and, uh, you know, obviously hiding in the closet has been doing him some good. Absolutely. So, um, okay, we're just going to take a, take a brief sponsorship break. Sponsored by Monster. Monster Energy Drink. It gives you wings, sir. Maybe it's the other one. Red Bull. I'm sorry. Wrong sponsor. And we're back. Okay, and Cold Rift is back in the library. Um, doing a nice, good crouching style. As you can hear, there was a bit of a whisper. So we're going to see if Cold Rift is going to look around to avoid the jump scares. Okay, so, so far, so good. No jump scare. I really have no idea how Cold Rift has been playing this and uh, having very little, uh, you know, uh, monster interactions. But here we are in the library. And... Uh, we're gonna just try. So Cold Rift is doing the long game, it is slow and low. So as you can see, the monster here is getting very agitated and confused. Um, and the monster, oh, I think the monster may have just seen Cold Rift. Cold Rift is gonna sneak over to the right. And Cold Rift is aiming towards that desk that has the blue logo. Oh, oh, the monster may, oh, oh, the monster is coming back. Okay, Cold Rift is running. We are seeing where Cold Rift is running. And has evaded the monster. Perfect. Okay, that was a one-two dive right there, as you can see. The WASD keys were used very well. Um, so we're going to... Oh, oh, here's a whisper again. Okay, is it going to be a jump scare? Okay. So it oh, looks like the monster has gone to the upper mezzanine levels, but has... Cold Rift has evaded capture. Excellent, excellent. Okay, so, um, so we've been stuck at this for probably about five minutes or so, but Cold Rift is definitely going for the long game here. Um, we are making sure that we don't get caught because in the event you get caught by this monster, it is instant death. Okay, so there's the monster there. So Cold Rift is gonna try the evasion maneuver. Okay, so we can hear the monster somewhere around. Okay, so it looks like, uh, oh, everything's gone dark. Oh, never mind. it was just the camera. Okay, okay, so so far so good. We're thinking that perhaps we can't really hear the monster anymore, which is a uh, big scary, especially if you have toddlers. Once you stop hearing them, that's when you know things are about to go down. Okay, and now we're back. Okay, we can hear the monster. The monster is making its squishy squish noise with its gross ass feet. And um, so we're essentially aiming to, um, we're looking for, oh, there, there he is again. There he is again. And uh, oh, has he seen our hero? No, okay. Okay, the monster is indeed quite stupid. Excellent. So we're going to keep going. Cold Rift has evaded capture. Oh, but it's getting close. Okay. Oh, oh, but the monster is going up to the mezzanine. Does Cold Rift have time to get to the desk? Let's see what's going to happen. Let's see what's going to happen. Okay, so it looks like the monster is up into the mezzanine. Looking very concerned. Okay, the monster is coming back because it was reading a book and then got bored. Cold Riff is still in a crouching position, hiding behind the last bookshelves on the wall here. Um, so we are aiming toward anything that is blue. Okay, so oh, so Cold Riff is going up to the mezzanine. Guys, he's going up to the mezzanine. The monster is looking away, unfazed, unfazed. There is a big lock on the door. Oh, Cold Riff is gonna feel this one for sure, guys. Cold Riff is thinking. Perhaps trying to unlock the lock with his mind. Not working. So it looks like we need to find some sort of blue book. Or there's some sort of paper. We don't really know what's happening right now. As Cold Riff is stoic. Cold Riff is looking around at his options. Uh, looks like the monster is uh, is not happy. The monster is making its way up to the mezzanine. Is Cold Riff going to hide? Oh my goodness. Cold Rift. Is the cold rift able to evade capture? Okay, the monster is where where we can't see him because the cameras are not very great. Okay, I hear stomping. I hear chomping. But it looks like I hear a cold rift is still in one piece. Just gonna take a quick sponsorship break. Um, this uh, this break is brought to you by Kraft Peanut Butter. When you're in a sticky situation, why not add some peanut butter? Kraft Peanut Butter. 
Okay, and we're back. All right, perfect. Uh, okay, and here's Coldriff here, still trying to unlock the lock with his mind. It so far has not been successful, but the monster is stupid. So, and uh, Coldriff has been evading capture up to this point. The monster is now over here. Oh, I think the monster got a got a close grip. Got a close look at Cold Rift. Cold Rift is uh, now trying to evade capture. They are both on the mezzanine. Will the monster see Cold Rift? Um, ah, the look at like it looks like Cold Rift was able to evade capture once more. Oh, 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 oh! We are in a closet. We are in a closet. I repeat, the monster is waiting outside the closet for Cold Rift. Can Cold Rift survive? Okay, the monster does indeed know that he is there. This monster is made of meat and grossness. You can see um, he has exactly three rib cages on either side. And the monster got bored and is now leaving. Excellent. Looks like Cold Rift was not evicted from the closet just yet. Oh, look at these back. Oh, oh, okay. Well, the monster is just as, as confused as we all are, ladies and gentlemen. Okay, and Cold Rift has exited the closet. Okay, we are hearing a whisper. We are hearing a whisper sound. All right, Cold Rift has looked around. There is no jump scare available, so Cold Rift is going to try to go down we need to make it down to that blue desk that is the blue desk that we are aiming for so cold Rift is going to be a little bit more ballsy this time cold Rift is i think believe i believe cold Rift has now learned the pattern of the monster and knows that it is safe to head over this way okay the monster is heading up to the mezzanine all right cold Rift is out of the crawling position has gotten this blue piece of paper that is very interesting I have no idea what it says, but hopefully Cold Rift knows what it says. Okay, all right, so the monster is back up on the mezzanine level. And the monster is coming down. Monster has spotted Cold Rift. Cold Rift is as cool as a cucumber, evading capture like a genius. Okay, Cold Rift is now heading up to the mezzanine. Now that he has the code to the lock, he will successfully unlock the code. Oh, 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 he made a wrong turn there. Let's see if that was a dastardly move. Oh, uh, uh, the monster has spotted Cold Rift. The monster is heading up to the mezzanine level. Oh, oh, Cold Rift is confused. Cold Rift doesn't know what to do. Cold Rift is stuck behind a pillar. The monster is here. Oh, but the monster did not see him. Okay, but the monster is still on second mezzanine level. Okay, here's the monster. The monster's butt cheeks are in the way. There we go. Okay. The monster is leaving the second mezzanine. Will this be enough time for Cold Rift to unlock the lock? Only time will tell, guys. Okay, okay. Okay, and the monster is back down at the bookshelf. Lugging around like a goof. Cold Rift is now working on the lock. Now that he has the code from the piece of paper, we will see if he can get through in time. There is a little bit of stomping going on here, so it's hard to tell where exactly the monster is. But we can see on the other side of the door. It looks like this is going to be an interesting room once Cold Rift unlocks this final piece. Okay. Cold Rift is still working on the lock. Something doesn't make any sense. Okay, it looks like a triangle. Uh, perhaps a roundiness. So the triangle, as you guys can see, is not present in the, in the uh, legend over here. There is only a square. A diamond, a star, an X, and a zero. So Cold Rift is very confused, as are all of we back at home. All right, guys, we're just going to take a quick, a quick sponsorship break. This break is sponsored by the letter C for Cold Rift. Excellent. Okay. Also, um, Kang says, "LOL, the commentary is great." Deathblood says, I joined the Discord. Coda says, I've been playing Plane Crazy, a Roblox game, and I'm having to rebuild half my plane because I made it too long. Uh, Coda, totally get you. Excellent, excellent work. All right, guys, and we're back. Cold Earth says, I don't have the shapes on the paper. You're missing. Triangle is missing. Or, as I like to say, triangle, because when I'm under stress, I cannot type correctly. Okay, guys, and we're back. Okay, Cold Rift is going to go back to the desk, and there might be another piece of paper that might actually have the triangle on it. So we're going to try and figure this puzzle out. However, Cold Rift only has one shot at this. If Cold Rift gets hit by the monster, it is game over. 
Coda says, thing is, it wouldn't be so bad if the plane I was, wasn't was trying to make was wasting huge ugh. Coda, I totally understand your frustration. Speaking of frustration, this next sponsorship is sponsored by Frustration, the board game. All right, and we're back. Okay, everyone, so we got the monster here. We can see his supple butt cheeks as uh, Cold Riff just uh, passes by. So Cold Riff is, uh, I'm wondering if Cold Riff is just gonna take a gamble. Oh, Cold Riff has suddenly found the triangle. However, the monster was almost on his buttocks. So we're pretty close there. Okay, I believe Cold Riff has all the information that he needs. Okay, it looks like they the Cold Rift got a special book that had the triangle, which is equal to the number four. So, we are hearing loud footsteps from the monster. Uh, we, I think the monster is close, but it looks like Cold Rift is evading capture once more. All right. Okay, we're just trying to keep a close eye on, on Cold Rift. Um, the, unfortunately, the camera settings can be kind of sucky, so sometimes we can't see everything. But I hear noises. I hear fast noises. It looks like he's down off the mezzanine. He's on the second level there. Okay, so Cold Rift is back for reasons unknown. Um, I thought, oh my God, get away. How is this guy? Okay, this monster is clearly stupid. All right, Cold Rift is going and trying to find some information. Okay, they found a green book. And the green book has a, what is that? One, two, three, four, five, six, hexagon shape. Okay. Uh, okay, so it looks like we have a square, we have a diamond, we have a star, X, O, triangle, rhombus perhaps? And a hexagon. Is that a rhombus? Number one, if anyone can tell me what number one, the shape of number one is in the comments below, I will say it on stream. Okay, perfect. Speaking of stream, this next sponsorship is by Steam, which almost sounds like Steam. Okay, and we're back. <laughs> so I can understand why I was not hired for that esports job because I clearly suck at uh, commentating. But um, speaking of sucking, this next sponsor is Chubba Chub which is the best lollipops on the planet. Okay, so now Cold Rift, we believe, has all of the shapes he needs. Cold Rift has unlocked the door! All right, Cold Rift is into the next room. We have defeated the monster. All right, Cold Rift is up and not crouching anymore. Okay, and we're back, guys. Okay, this is gonna be a fast-paced game. Um, PJ just, uh, Justice says hexagon, maybe. No, hexagon is the one, is hex, is three. No, no, hex is six points octagon is eight points that one was like maybe five it was a little bit different okay oh and we're hearing sounds okay and we're back and cold rift is confident and doing great okay cold rift is going down into the cellar is this the wine cellar that we saw earlier yes this um the, the purveyor of this establishment was a big fan of ale or perhaps wines there are lots of different barrels down here did you know that in the uh 1800s uh water wasn't purified so it was actually safer to drink beer than it was water excellent okay and now we are back cold riff is still continuing through okay we are at amazing doors uh i don't even know if these doors are like in numerical order okay it looks like oh it looks like perhaps cold riff heard something that we didn't hear okay have not seen anything so far okay then perhaps that was just a safety measure I did not see or hear any ghosty sounds, so I think we are good. All right, and Cold Rift is continuing. Okay, we are hiding for safe measure. This is room number 58. Okay, so far so good. Okay, so, okay, instead of the stairs, we are taking the room. Okay, this room is dark and a little bit spooky. Okay, so we're at uh, door number 59. We don't know how many doors it does take, so this is the Last Supper Roblox. Very interesting. Okay, is this room number 60? Okay, it looks like, oh... Something happened here. Oh dear. Perhaps we should be hiding in a closet. Some papers went flying, but perhaps Cold Rift is not impressed. All right, we're heading for 61. Okay, so it looks like these are in numerical order. Okay, for a good measure, Cold Rift is hiding. Let's see if there's a reason for him to hide. I do hear sounds of a monster. Let's go! 
And that's that guy who kills me all the time. The guy with the smiley face who's super annoying. Excellent. And we're back. Cold Riff is heading over to door number 63. Oh. Kenny says that that shape was a pentagon. Just like the pentagon that the Americans have. Which I think is the same shape. This uh, next sponsorship is brought to you by... Uh... The American uh, government, because why not? Okay, oh, Cold Rift hit, and that was a great call to hide, because that monster, who's a jerk, uh, definitely came through. Okay, and over here, we have some amazing rain textures. Fantastic. Um, and we're going to hit number door 67. Okay, so 67 has gone through. Okay, uh, Cold Rift is still pretty confident and fantastic. It looks like life bar is good, even though I can't see it. I imagine it is. All right, and on the left we have a beautiful uh, brick staircase. No, staircase. Oh my god, beautiful brick uh, chimney. Did you know that if you own a house, you have to have your chimney inspected every month, or else it's illegal to light it up? Apparently. Okay, Coldorf is now into the drawers. Has found nothing except for a secret love letter with a red seal. Uh, okay. Oh, we found door seventy. But it looks like there is a lock, so it looks like Coldriff is going to have to go through some more drawers and try to find the key for number 70. Okay, I believe he may have found something, but mm, usually it it lights up blue, so it probably wasn't that what he needed. Okay, here we go, and we have found the blue key. All right, excellent, and we are heading towards the blue door, number 70, and we're through! Excellent! Oh, man, the lights are going crazy. Is Coldriff going to take a chance? Coldriff, oh, there's a... There's a whisper. Okay, Cold Rift is taking a chance. We are hiding out. And we saw the stupid guy with the stupid face. And he has opened the next door. Excellent. Okay, now Cold Rift is continuing into the dark. We are trying to find perhaps 71. We don't really know. Okay, we are back into the lovely wine cellar once more. We're the aging process. Perhaps these are barrels of tobacco. We have no idea. I'm assuming it's wine. Also, that reminds me, I've been trying to ferment wine in my basement. And uh, I actually pr should probably check on that soon. Okay. As an Italian, I feel like a failure uh, for not knowing how to make wine. Uh, okay, here it is. Okay, we're at number 60 to 72. Okay, and we are back. Continuing. All right. And we are back. We're going to door number 73. Fantastic. Oh, okay. We got a little bit of a light, light glitch. But Cold Riff is going to continue moving forward. We did hear the bit of a scary sound. Cold Riff is going to hide just for good measure. Great call. Because that guy who sucks came back. Okay, but it looks like the good thing about monsters is that they option actually open doors, which is kind of cool. But uh, they're scary. Me no lucky. All right. Oh, wow. Okay, Cold Riff has suddenly pulled out the flashlight. I didn't realize you had a flashlight this whole time. Okay, oh, someone's hiding. We're hiding. Okay, good call. I didn't even hear that. Yep, there he is. A big jerk face. Okay, perfect. And there's also a whisper. Started with a whisper. This next break is sponsored by Spotify, where you have to pay to listen to music. Spotify. And we're back. Okay. <laughs> and we're aiming for door number 78. Oh, my God. What the hell is that, guys? Uh, That's the spooky shit. Okay, and we're bypassing spooky shit and entering door number 79. Okay, and door 80. Perfect. Okay. Cat Food says, if you beat the game, I will give you nothing. All right. It looks like Cold Riff is taking a little bit of a mental break just to purvey the, the spookiness. Okay. Okay, it looks like the eyes on the wall are looking at you, which is a little bit spooky. What's going on here? Okay, don't know what that was, but uh, perhaps Cold Riff was waiting for that knocking to occur. Okay, we're door number 81. Oh, God, there's eyeballs on the wall. Don't look at them. They're creepy. All right. And door number 82. And uh, lots of, like, emotion. Okay. Coldriff is hiding into the closet. Is this the right call? Okay. It looks like that was the right call to make. Okay. Which... Oh, boy. Okay. Coldriff is purveying the options here. Okay. All the eyeballs are being really creepy. Not a good time. Okay, okay. Looks like there's a little bit of spookiness here. Okay. Cold Rift has a key. Um. I don't know what the key is for. 84. Oh, wow. Alright, Cold Rift knew that the key was over there. That's fantastic. Okay. 
Coldriff is running through the corridor that is already, and uh, perhaps nothing here. Oh, God. Oh, I spoke too soon, ladies and gentlemen. We have the guy with the one eyeball who comes out of the sledge. There's going to be a lot of crouching here. Coldriff is going to have to do a lot of uh, quick time actions. Okay, we're heading into that door. Okay, and now we're heading into this door. Okay, let's see if Coldriff... No oh, man, Coldriff is killing it. Great job. Okay, we're so far headed into three doors. We're still... There's still a chase to be had. Okay, and here we go. Let's go. Okay, we're in... Uh, I can't even tell. Okay, oh my god, there's hands everywhere and the fire... Everything's on fire. And there's eyeballs. Okay, this is nasty. Super nasty. I don't know how you're doing it. Did Coldriff, Coldriff indeed has survived? I think. Oh god, never mind! Ah! Okay. Okay, okay. Well, yeah, Coldriff did it. Fantastic. Wow, wow, wow. Justice says, yeah, oh, I miss Spooky She. Kang says, lol. Chihiro says, oh, ha. Oh, is this his first time beating it? Well, good luck. I have no idea. I think so. Kang says, maybe. Chihiro says, I can't believe I missed. Kang says, miss what? The game. Um, Kang says, there will be a chance. Ah. Okay. All right, guys. And we're back. We are commentating on Cold Rift. Cold Rift is now looking through some drawers, um, seeing if we can find anything. Um, I wish they had the door at the top so they could tell you what went through. Perhaps 90? I don't know. It's kind of, it went by super fast. This is why I would be a terrible esports commentator. Okay. Speaking of terrible. Our next sponsor is McDonald's. Ba -da -ba -ba -ba. Why is your ice cream machine broken? And we're back. All right. <laughs> Man, I had ice cream from them last time, and it was all scoopy, and they had to put it in a cup. What's that about? Oh, oh, oh. Did the lights go? Okay. Oh, Cold Rife is hiding in the closet. We're seeing something, perhaps? Oh, I hear it. I hear it. There's a wow, green... No! Green spooky face. Are you dead? <gasps> no. 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 You dead? You dead? What? Is our hero dead? Kenny says no. Your hero says GGS. Oh, no. And I think this is his corpse, if I'm not mistaken. I was going to go to 100 and stop. Oh, no. And it's GG. 